Hey guys, welcome back to my Black Arch tool demoing series. And today we're going to be looking at a network analysis framework called Zeek. Now, the first thing we want to do is look for the interface that we like to capture traffic on. So I type if config and we'll be getting traffic from the wireless local area network. And let's now go to the file where we have to specify which interface. So let's change directories to where the Z config information is located. So let's do sudo or sorry cd user slash etc ls and it's this file right here called node.config we need root privileges to edit it so let's do sudo and then nano text editor space node.config and you can specify which right here by default mine was set to ETH zero, but you want to do wireless local area network zero today. Um, if you're on a desktop computer with no Wi-Fi card, obviously you choose the other one. But anyway, now that we have that, let's save it. Great, it's done. Now we can go back to a regular directory and let's run Zeek. So sudo zeek control and we have to type in a command called deploy to configure it. Um, okay. Starting stopping zeek. All right, now it's started. Um, and this means it is absolutely capturing traffic right now. So next we'll I'll show you the traffic to um, that's going to Zeek in the logs folder. So we do, um, I'll clear the terminal, cd slash user slash logs ls. And these are the Zeek uh, logs of traffic that's being captured. This is like one of the main functions of Zeek here. So if we do change to current, um, since Zeek is currently running, it will leave the. Um, these are the current running uh, in real time. Is is uh, how these change. So let's do cat packet underscore filter dot log. All right, we get to see some information there. And let's do stats dot log. Okay, awesome. So this is the traffic it's it's currently capturing right now, and as you can see, um, there's also an option for um, what's it where to go. Oh, there's also an option to check out loaded scripts, and you can, this is a very scriptable tool here. So anyway, let's go back to the previous folder, back to logs and ls, and this is the log that's been saved uh, after when Zeek stops, it will save uh, the, the log information into a different folder. So this is the running folder, this is the already ran folder. So let's do cd. 2023-01-25 ls and wow there's a whole lot of uh, capture information here this because I had it on and off earlier today but anyway in order to open these uh, log.gz files we just do gun zip dash d for decompress and let's see which one uh, let's check out what's in reporter. Oops, you got to have root privileges. Sorry about that. Sudo. All right. 
Now, now that it's decompressed, we just get rid of the GZ in the end, so it's log. Oh, whoops, another mistake. Okay. LS. I meant cat, actually. All right, so here's some information on the wireless interface. Now, for other information, let's check out, try to find a good one. Stats. All right, here's just a juicier file with more information. Let's do, we'll just pick a, um, the most recent connection. Yeah, oh, that one's too small. We'll do this one. It was capturing for about three minutes. So let's go back, sudo gunzip-d, connection, con for connection, all right, cat, control shift v, let's get rid of gz, now let's look, all right, Let's do a connection summary. This is the one I was looking for, by the way. So, cat, control shift V, get rid of the GZ. All right, awesome. So. These are all the things passing through our interface. And yeah, so that's how um, how you do basic traffic capturing with Zeek. And it's a very useful tool. You can also script it, as I said. Um, please check out docs.zeek.org for more information. They have a great piece of documentation here. So, all right, guys, that's all for today. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and check out my website, hackguru.tech, if you haven't already. All right, bye bye.